subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi, welcome to Test Prep Training. Today we will discuss about, Exam MS 700, Managing Microsoft Teams. This certification helps you achieve your goals, and tests your expertise in managing Microsoft Teams. It is quite a difficult exam because of the vast syllabus. If you're aiming for this exam, you are in luck because here we'll be presenting you with our tutorials, and preparatory guide. Now we will talk about, why choose Microsoft MS 700. The Microsoft MS 700 is a highly acclaimed certification. This exam makes your resume shine and grabs the attention of your potential employers. The benefits of Microsoft 70 to 761 exam are. First, validates your skills. This certification validates your mastery in planning and configuring Microsoft Teams. It demonstrates your expertise and knowledge. Second, enhances employability. This certification certifies your skills and therefore enhances your employability by making you job ready. Third, higher growth opportunities. This certification guarantees high growth opportunities. About 23% of Microsoft certified professionals reported receiving up to a 20% salary increase. It also helps you chase further advanced goals in the field of IT. Fourth, provides competitive edge. Microsoft certifications provide you with a competitive edge over non-certified candidates. It is estimated that certified employees earn 15% more than those without certification, and are nearly 20% more productive. Fifth, brings recognition. You'll make immediate impact as a Microsoft certified professional. This credential will help you in getting noticed and bring recognition. Additionally, once you're certified you'll be able to share your achievements through your Microsoft badge. This Microsoft badge can be shared online within your professional network as it trusted, and verifiable. It also helps find jobs easily, and increases your salary potential. Certification Details By successfully completing the MS 700 Managing Microsoft Teams exam, you will earn the certification for Microsoft 365 Certified Teams Administrator Associate. This definitely is a great reason, to have this much admired exam in your academic records. Exam Details, Microsoft MS 700 The exam includes 40 to 60 number of questions. The questions will appear in the form of multiple choice. The candidate will get 120 minutes to complete the exam. The exam is available in various languages such as English, Japanese, Chinese, Korean. The candidate has to pay 165 US dollars as the examination fee. Now, we will discuss about, who should go for this exam. The candidates planning to take managing Microsoft Teams MS 700, this exam must be proficient in managing Teams settings by using PowerShell. As Teams administrator, you should understand how to integrate external apps and services. Moreover, you should also be able to configure, deploy, and manage Office 365 workloads for Microsoft Teams that focus on efficient and effective collaboration and communication in an enterprise environment. How to schedule the exam The Microsoft MS 700 Managing Teams exam is built to test your abilities of planning and configuring Microsoft Teams. The exam can be scheduled as For non-students interested in technology, at Pearson VUE For students or instructors, at Certiport Exam Retake Policy If you were not able to clear the exam in the very first attempt, then remember it's not the end of the road, but just a small bump. Microsoft allows you 5 attempts per year for a specific exam. The exam retake policy is as follows. First, if a candidate is not able to clear the exam in the first attempt, the candidate must wait at least 24 hours before retaking the exam. Second, if a candidate does not clear the exam the second time, candidate must wait at least 14 days before retaking the exam a third time. Third, a 14-day waiting period is also there for the fourth and fifth subsequent exam retakes. Now, we will talk about, cancellation, and reschedule policy. Microsoft allows free cancelling of the exam, within 24 hours prior to your scheduled appointment. But, if you fail to show up on your exam day without rescheduling, or cancelling your exam, Microsoft reserves all rights to forfeit your entire exam fee. Rescheduling, and cancellation of your scheduled exams can be done through the certification dashboard. Exam Course, Microsoft MS 700 the Microsoft MS 700 exams course includes three domains. Moreover, the percentage against each domain represents its weightage in the exam. Domains are further divided into subtopics which will be further discussed. 
First, plan and configure a Microsoft Teams environment, which compromises 45 to 50% weightage for this exam. Second, manage chat, calling, and meetings, which compromises 30 to 35% weightage for this exam. Third, manage Teams and app policies, which compromises 20 to 25% weightage for this exam. Let us now talk about course outline topics in detail. First, plan and configure a Microsoft Teams environment. Number 1, upgrade from Skype for business to Microsoft Teams. It contains four subtopics which are First, choose an appropriate upgrade path and coexistence mode to meet specific requirements. Second, plan and troubleshoot meeting migration. Third, configure Microsoft Teams upgrade notification and meeting app choices. Fourth, configure coexistence mode for the organization and peruser. Number 2, plan and configure network settings for Microsoft Teams. It contains five subtopics which are First, plan for successful network deployment by using Network Planner. Second, calculate network bandwidth capacity for Microsoft Teams voice, video, meetings, and live events. Third, assess network readiness by using the network testing companion. Fourth, configure network ports and protocols used by Microsoft Teams client application. Fifth, configure media optimizations by using QoS. Number three, implement governance and lifecycle management for Microsoft Teams. It contains four subtopics which are First, create team templates. Second, set up policies for Office 365 groups creation. Third, configure Office 365 groups for Microsoft Teams classifications, expiration policy, and naming policy. Fourth, archive, restore, and delete a team. Second, manage chat, calling, and meetings. Number one, manage chat and collaboration experiences. It contains seven subtopics which are First, configure messaging policies. Second, manage external access. Third, manage channels for a team. Fourth, manage private channel creation policies. Fifth, manage email integration. Sixth, configure external access for SharePoint and OneDrive for business. Seventh, manage cloud file storage options for collaboration. Number two, manage meeting experiences. It contains five subtopics which are First, configure meeting settings Second, create and manage meeting policies Third, configure settings for live events Fourth, create and manage policies for live events Fifth, configure conference bridge settings Number 3, manage phone numbers It contains six subtopics which are First, recommend a PST and connectivity solution based on specific business requirements. Second, order phone numbers. Third, manage service numbers. Fourth, add, change, or remove an emergency address for your organization. Fifth, assign, change, or remove a phone number for a user. Sixth, manage voice settings for users. Third, manage teams and app policies. Number one, manage a team. It contains four subtopics which are First, create a team Second, upgrade an existing resource to a team Third, manage privacy levels for a team Fourth, manage org-wide teams Number two, manage membership in a team It contains three subtopics which are First, manage users in a team Second, configure dynamic membership Third, manage access review for team members Number 3, Implement Policies for Microsoft Teams Apps It contains two subtopics which are First, Create and Manage App Permission Policies Second, Create and Manage App Setup Policies Now, we will discuss about Preparatory Guide, Microsoft MS 700 The key to crack an exam is by preparing right Preparations demand consistency and determination We present you our specially curated preparatory guide to help you achieve the Microsoft MS 700 exam certification in the very first attempt. Let's discuss step by step. First, refer the official exam guide. Firstly, you need to go through the official guide of Microsoft MS 700 exam. Familiarize yourself with all the objectives and course domains of the exam. Devote enough time to each topic and have in-depth knowledge of the subject. Second, devise a study plan. 
The next step is to strategize a study plan for your preparations. Following your plan will help you remain consistent and also help in avoiding distractions. While devising a plan, keep in mind the exam objectives and time duration left for the real exam. Start by brushing up your weaker sections. Remember the key to excel is to start early, hence begin with your preparations and stay motivated. Third, books, your best friends. Books are the most important ingredient of preparation. There are a vast variety of books available in the market, which you can use to prepare for the Microsoft MS 700 exam. Therefore, our suggestion to you would be to find books for the exam from genuine sources. Fourth, learn from online resources. There are plenty of online resources available online for the preparation of your Microsoft MS 700 exam. Each resource tries to offer you clarity about your exam domains. Fifth, go for a training course. Microsoft provides its own training courses for the preparation of this exam. We know that being a practical exam, it requires hands-on training. Therefore, to solve this issue Microsoft has come up with training options in two modes. Hence, choose the one that best suits you. Instructor-led training, the Microsoft instructor-led training is similar to the traditional classroom training setting. You can in-depth understanding of the exam course and hands-on experience. Online training, online training offered by Microsoft is an ultimate resource for you to prepare. Such training help you learn on your own schedule, at your own pace, and in your own place. Sixth, practice tests. Practice tests are really significant to check your preparations. They provide you with insights about your strengths and weaknesses. Strengthening your weakness will help you ace the exam. Attempt as many practice papers as you can and try to perform better than the previous one each time. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.